What is up everybody welcome back to a new tutorial and um today we're gonna be creating a clothing store advertisement design so um start off with a canvas is 160 by 600 now i just went online and i just grabbed a low um, sky background as you can see so i'm just gonna place it right here now most likely you're going to be using your own render but since i don't have one um i just went ahead and i just grabbed a free one off of google so you're gonna right click and go to go into your blending options. Go bevel and emboss. Pump this up a little bit. Just like that. Alright, so I like how that looks. I'm gonna add an inner shadow. Okay. Uh, bring this up, size down distance up a little bit just like that now you can just look for some patterns and images so i just went ahead and grabbed some flower pictures place it right here and also at the top you could also add some patterns in the back all right so i'm gonna lower this there we go add your logo at the top of the screen and uh let's see how it looks all right it's not bad just put that right there now you could just add your text so i'm gonna type um new clothing all right i think this is um this is fine so let's just enlarge this and then make it bolder then i'm just gonna take the effect i put on the logo which is right here right click copy it and just paste it onto the text now we're gonna take everything have the top layer selected hold shift and then click on the bottom one Control G, Control J, and then Control E. And once you have this, Control J once more. And once you have this, do Control A, and then Control C, Control V. You hide this, and then Control J one more time. So now that we have this, we could go up to Camera Raw Filter, bring the vibrance up. You can bring up the texture. Now, if you don't have this filter, then you probably need to update your Photoshop. So now you just want to play around with these settings until you get something that you like. Now to finish it off. When you go down here, go to exposure. You want to bring the exposure up, right? Now you want to bring the offset up, just like that, and take the gamma correction and also drag this up. So yeah, if you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you leave a like, and I'll see you all next time. Check out robloxvisuals.com for the latest Roblox graphics templates. We have just added some new FPS shooter UI templates, some full simulator UI sets. Check it out and use code YT for 15% off all purchases.